this is who that who who that. What's up, baby? This is Garby G. And as you guys know, this is another hair review. And today we are reviewing Love Me Hair. Do I love them though? I don't know. Love is a strong word. We have Love Me Hair. I don't know. Was it raining when they get? But this is a very cute packaging look. Period. The little cute little ribbon and everything. Doing a damn thing. Purr. In this wig, we have a bob. We got, oh, oh. What did it say? Oh, thank you, Helena. Helena. Um, we have a goodie bag. I ain't never seen one of these combs in black. Hold on now. Cause hold on. Let's see what's up in this goodie bag. Let me guess. Hair clips, lashes, probably a thin satin scarf. That was specific. So if I'm right, girl, I'm a psychic. Lashes. Oh, 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 ooh, ooh. This is cute. This is real cute. Oh, girl, they did not get me nothing that I thought I got. Um. We got nails. Hold on now. This is them pop-on nails. Oh, wait a minute. I'm gonna use one of them in the video one day. I got to try. I got to try. And what's this? Is this air freshener? What? And this. It's heavy, but I don't know what it is. It's like a little thingy. I don't know. Anyway, thank you so much, Love Me Hair. Put these back. I'm not bending down no more. I can't. I can't bend down no more, y'all. It be, it be, it goes straight to my knees. I mean, duh, girl, you using them, stupid. Straight to my knees it go. Let's go ahead and check out this wig. Oh, this has an, also has an elastic strap on there. Um, This is a bob wig. And it's a curly unit, curly wave unit or so. Oh, oh, it also has the it's adjusted strap just in case if I need to make it a little tighter. Thank you. I really appreciate that. You feel me? Let's see what it's looking like. Okay. Okay. Let's try to shed and chest. Bob wigs, I ain't gonna lie, Bob wigs, they don't shed. Not even gonna cap at you. Bob wigs don't really shed like that. So this shed, baby. See, like I'm, I'm, I'm actually being quite aggressive. I'm not getting nothing. I'm getting like little, you know, flying hairs coming off. But I got like two, three strands. You know, see, like two, three strands. Um, I see that this is not pre-plugged. Um, so we're gonna have to really do this. We're gonna have to do some damage with this. Sorry, got to. Gotta do some damage with this, baby. We gonna have to cut. We gotta, girl. What? Why would they do this to me? Anyway, but this is the. And this is, oh my gosh! And it's also, it, it kind of reminds me of a T part, like. And I feel like this also makes it, like, it'll be better for you to have a side part, something like that. Cause you don't see how it's kind of tilted to the side. You don't see. I see it though. Maybe it's because, no, it's probably not to the side, just the part making it look like that. Okay. Well, this is a 13 by 4, but the sides are barely an inch. So we need to, we're going to have to seek it through with this. Okay. I did not expect that. But is it bad? Is it bad? I don't think it's too bad. We, we're going to still figure it out. But this is the wig. I will take off my bonnet, but you know, I got respect. So I'm gonna just. Good thing it ain't going on me though, babe. Cause I look like the witch from that uh, that old show that got caught under the house. Yeah. But we gonna go ahead and check how this wig look like on the next baby doll we put it on. And I'm gonna see you on the next side. babies we're back and please do not let this fool you i went through hell 
not even gonna lie, with trying to have this wig look like this. But before we begin, we're gonna start off with the good parts. To start off, the knots were very beautiful. It was very easy for me to bleach. I actually didn't even have to leave the chemical on for too long because it did seem like the hair came pre-bleached, but the knots were still very visible. So instead of me leaving it on for 15, 20 minutes, I kind of left it on for like probably about like 10 to 12 at most. The hair was very soft. It was also quite manageable. To me, I received more of a water wave versus loose curl vibe. When the hair dries, it comes off. It looks soft. It looks fluffy. And it is, it's still pretty cute, if you ask me. Y'all go ahead and comment down below how y'all feel about it. But this is how the hair looks when it's wet. So I'm going to go ahead and go through and wet the whole head so y'all can see what it looks like for real, for real, in its wet state. And this is how the hair looks when it's wet. There's still a nice amount of volume. It's also quite shiny, if you ask me. Believe it or not, I actually didn't put nothing but just water on this hair. So the quality of this wig is pretty high, especially for a bob wig. So now this is where it gets interesting. As you guys know, I absolutely had no space on the sides. So even if I wanted to, I did make an attempt. I could not pluck anything out you guys see the space that one portion alone i kid you not is probably smaller than a centimeter that is what i disliked about the wig i hate the fact that it had no space it bothered me i literally had to completely butcher this wig to not only fit her head but to also get around her ears i had to go as far as even cutting some piece of the cap off that was around the ear area but Leave it to me to always figure out a way out, you feel me? So what I decided to do was, instead of letting it bother me because there was no space, thankfully enough, because of how much lace I decided to leave out, like I barely cut any lace off. Because the lace was already small as it is. Despite of that, I was still able to use the lace to create a hairline for her. This was no HD lace, it was actually a Swiss brown lace, but if you look closely, you can see how much lace I had to leave out in order to achieve this look. And let's have a word from our sponsors. It's the front toe. <laughs> <laughs> no, it look like, like a don't front play. toe. Don't play. don't play with Big B. Trev, okay, let's get up. Although I had a hard time installing this wig, it came out beautiful. And I was even more happy with the fact that she loved her hair so much. So if you guys are still interested, please check the links in the description down below. There will be a direct link to this wig as well as Love Me Hair website. Thank you so much for tuning in. BG.